Hi and welcome to another Instrument Choice Support video. In this video we'll demonstrate how to calibrate pH on the IC860031 benchtop pH meter. Calibration is essential before you begin to take measurements and at regular intervals to ensure your pH meter is working correctly. Once you have your pH meter switched on, the pH and temperature sensor connected and the electrode holder arm installed, you can start your calibration. For calibration, you'll need some distilled or deionized water. Ensure you rinse the probe in the deionized water after removing the electrode cap. Along with buffer solutions, we recommend a minimum of two point calibration for enhanced accuracy. For this example, we're using pH 4.01 and pH 7. The IC860031 allows you to select between two different groups of pH buffers. There's NIST. The buffer recognition points in this group are pH 1.68, 4.01, 6.86, 9.18, and 12.45 only. And custom. This group includes five different ranges. This is pH 1 to 3, 3.5 to 5.5, 6 to 8, 8.5 to 10.5, and 11.5 to 13.5. As some of the calibration points in the NIST group are less common in Australia, customers often pick custom buffer selection. As in this example, we are using pH 7 and pH 4.01 buffer solution, we will need to use the device's custom buffer setting. To adjust to the custom buffer setting, press and hold the set key for 2 seconds. Press the up arrow until BUF and P 4.0 appear on the LCD. Press the enter key. Either CUST or NIST will blink on the LCD. Press the up arrow key until CUST blinks on the LCD. Then press enter to confirm your selection. The device will return to the main settings menu. Press escape to return to measurement mode. With the custom buffer set selection and our solutions ready, we can now perform a calibration. Immerse the electrode into your first pH buffer solution. Stirring the probe gently to ensure a uniform sample. Press cal to enter into calibration mode. On the display, the measured value appears on the top line, the desired custom value on the second line, and cal will blink. You will need to adjust the custom value to match the buffer standard in use, for this example, pH 7. To do this, press the hold key to move through the available buffer ranges. The screen will display the midpoint of each range. So for pH 7 buffer solution, press hold until 7.00 appears on the second line. If the reading is stable and ready is displayed, press enter to perform calibration to pH 7. The screen will blink as calibration is occurring. Then once complete, the device will return to calibration mode. This time, the measured value will be the same as the custom buffer value. Remove the probe from the buffer solution and rinse in distilled water. Then immerse the electrode into the second buffer solution. This time, we will need to calibrate to pH 4.01. Press hold until the closest range to the pH buffer solution appears. In this case, it is pH 4.5. Then adjust the custom buffer by using the up and down arrows until the custom buffer reads 4.01, matching the solution. Press enter to confirm and begin the calibration to this buffer point. As with the first calibration, both lines on the screen will blink as the unit calibrates. Once complete, the device will return to calibration mode. This time, the measured value will be the same as the buffer value. From here, you can continue on and calibrate the unit up to a total of five points. So if you were to calibrate to pH 10 next, you would press hold until the nearest custom range appeared on the bottom of the screen. In this case, it would be 9.5. Then you'd use the up and down arrows to adjust this custom buffer to pH 10. However, for this example, as we're only calibrating to two points, our calibration is complete. To exit calibration mode, press the Cal Escape button. The device will return to normal pH measurement mode. Remove the electrode from the buffer solution, rinse in distilled water, and you can now begin to take accurate pH measurements with your desktop pH meter. For more information or help calibrating your meter, speak with an instrument choice scientist. Call 1300 737 871 or email customer-service at instrumentchoice.com.au. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.